Okay, so I have just wrapped 10 days worth of work, traveling around, started in London, went up to Scotland, went back to London, came to North Carolina, and this was my last day of working on the road. Um, you know, whenever I'm traveling around, I, I try to, because it's, the work is different, I'm usually uh, delivering, um, and, and I have to, well, we'll say perform, I guess, we all kind of have to perform on a day-to-day -day basis, especially when we're working, but it's performing in a different way. So I reflect on it. I think about how I did. And I have to say, this trip, I, I, I wasn't at my best. I just wasn't. The difference though, because I am someone that can be very, very hard on myself. The difference this time is I'm not wrapping judgment around each thought. I'm just saying, okay, that didn't go as planned. That could have been done better. Not, that didn't go as planned. I'm a failure. It's horrible. You know, I talk about the three lies. Um, I've learned this from my friends, actually. They're, I have some pretty incredible people in my life. And uh, they say there's, there's these three lies, right? As I am, I'm not enough. Everything I have is going to go away. Nothing good is ever going to happen to me. And I'm really good at, at telling myself those three things. So this time has been different. I've separated from any kind of negative, morbid reflection that I, that I tend to go into. Um, and just said, you know what, next time I'm going to do it differently. And that actually feels good. There's some hope in that. So getting rid of judgment. Um, I was talking to someone the other day, and uh, they asked me about self-sabotage. And, you know, I think a lot of us do a good job. I do a good job of sabotaging things sometimes with, with negativity or, uh, again, if things don't go well, boom, I'll just I'll get angry or frustrated. Um, so I have to remember, you know, self-sabotage, the issue with it, and this was what the conversation was about, the issue with self-sabotage is the self, right? Whenever we're inside of ourself and we're trying to sort things out and we're isolating and it's, it's all in here, it's, it's, it becomes too much. And those negative thoughts ruminate and they get bigger and they grow and they put weight on top of our shoulders. And so I kind of feel like, this time, and, and in a strange way, you know, talking to this camera, which is then going to be put on some sort of platform, social media or something, um, is my way of being outside of myself a bit and putting it out there and sharing it so that it doesn't sit in here and I don't say, I got this, I can do this on my own. The reality is, you know, we all have the potential to, when things are bad, make them worse. So, two things today, got rid of judgment got curious. Curiosity is key. Secondly, instead of trying to deal with it on my own, I also am getting outside of myself. So I don't self-sabotage and make it worse. So thank you guys for listening. I am flying home tonight and I cannot wait to get back to my loved ones. Um, Rowan, I will see you soon, amigo. Be ready. Daddy's heading home. Bye for now, guys.